Hmm. Yeah, so that's interesting. Hello. You look as if you're interested in um, getting some predictions in advance of the physics exam. Well, I have some for you. Now, we'll start with the ordinary level. <clears throat> I think what you're getting this year in the long questions. Long questions, is that right? Basically, in the non experiment questions, is you should get something on sound waves. Ordinary level, this is now. Sound waves, electric mag magnetic induction, x rays and types of radiation, electric heating and specific heat capacity, resistance. Um, and possibly Newton and acceleration due to gravity and the spectrum of colours of light. They are the most likely ones um, to be coming up. Of the experiments, there's only two that have yet to be asked since the course started back in whatever it was, 2001 or 2002. And the two that haven't been asked yet, that you know, they could come up this year, are to investigate the laws of equilibrium in a set of coplanar forces or to investigate the variation of current with potential difference for a conductor. God, the names of these types of these experiments are so long and rambling. Um, then, apart from those two new ones, here are some sub, uh, some experiments that are very likely to be asked. The fuck? To show the relationship between force and acceleration, to verify Boyle's law, to measure the focal length of a concave mirror, to measure the specific latent heat of the fusion of, of vaporization of water, steam or whatever. Um, measure the resistance of a nichrome wire. For the higher level, um, you're, well, the elective comes up every year, so whatever elective you've picked, that's coming up. Also, waves and wave motion, resistance, electromagnetic induction, electrostatics, Nuclear fission and fusion, sound frequencies, harmonics, etc. And there are some of the main topics. In the experiments, there's a whole host of experiments since the course started that haven't been asked yet. Like to measure the refractive index of a liquid, to measure velocity or acceleration, show the relationship between force acceleration, to investigate the variation of current with potential difference for a conductor, like a wire, for example. Um, and there's others on the list as well. Um, the most likely repeat offenders to come up are to verify Boyle's law, measure the specific latent heat of the vaporization of water, and to verify Joule's law. Physics. <laughs>